it is July 24th today. Um, my parents and my sister just left this morning, so I had the house all to myself again, which is nice because I get overwhelmed pretty easily. My house is not that big, so having four people, it felt kind of crowded after a while. I actually tried filming last night. It felt really weird with my family still being in my house even though they were kind of off packing and doing their own stuff. But I still got so uncomfortable that I just gave up. So anyway, we went to the funeral last week or the week before. I'm not sure, but we did that and it was, well, I wouldn't say fun, but it was nice to see family again that I haven't seen. I mean, I didn't really say anything. I just kind of sat in my chair the whole time and didn't really talk with anyone unless they came up and started talking to me. Even though they're my family, I still get like, um, I, I guess it's kind of like this middle ground where I'm not totally comfortable with them yet, but I guess I would feel better than if they were complete strangers. And yesterday, I we went to my uncle's annual like family gathering. We call it the prom party because he lives on a lake. And I haven't been there in nine years, I think, so... It's been a long time, and the last time I didn't have a taxi when I went either. And I'm glad that I went, but I don't know if it's something I do every year, because it's just really hard for me to get around with the ataxia, since there are so many people there usually, and it's kind of not a huge space, but just like... There was maybe 30 or more people there, so it's just I don't feel comfortable moving around. So I just kind of sat in my chair out on the lawn for the whole time. We were there for uh, several hours, and I know I, I told my parents that I didn't want to be there that long, but you no, know, they were having a good time talking with everyone they hadn't seen in a while. And I just feel really bad saying like, oh, look at the time, can we go? Because, you know, I don't want to be like a party pooper. But then like, also, I don't want to be there anymore. It's not comfortable for me. And last thing. Thursday, I went to see a doctor because I don't have a neurologist anymore since my old one moved to Boston. And the one she had me see for a little bit after that, I didn't really like, so I haven't gone back in a while. But I really think I need a new neurologist because there have just been some things popping up that... <laughs> I want to have looked at. There was this one point where he was asking about like my anxiety history and stuff and basically I told him that I never feel anxious or anything and he was really kind of shocked by that and I just couldn't tell him that I have really bad social anxiety and I'm trying to deal with it as best I can. It's like even in really important situations there's just something inside holding me back from telling other people about it. But I finished my first class for summer quarter so I'm gonna start the second one tomorrow and with the volunteering with the horses that has been going pretty good. I did ask like several times like what do you need me to do because I feel like I'm just kind of flying blind here. I don't really have any direction as to 
what I should be doing at this time. Okay, so I, I've mentioned before that I feel anxious around pets and little kids. And I've realized that that's not entirely true. I mean, I do get anxious around animals, but I realize that it's because I fear that their owners or just anyone else probably might be around and be able to hear me or see me with them. Like when I'm pretty certain that we're completely alone, then I don't feel awkward around them. But if I have the slightest feeling that someone can hear me or see me interacting with any of the animals then I just start to feel anxious again and then I don't know if like putting on a show is exactly what I would call it but it's more like filtering my actions so it would seem more appropriate in case someone was watching. So anyway, that was what happened in the past couple weeks. I don't expect much else to happen in the next month or so because I'll just be finishing up with school and stuff. But if anything new happens, then I will definitely share it because it's probably a big deal for me anyway. <laughs>